All right, here he is, Serifax. <laughs> I'm going to need your help right off the bat here, people. Oh, Who's getting religion over there saying, oh, God? <laughs> that ain't the kind of help I need. I'm trying to keep this clean as possible. I'm trying not to say dirty words. I have a rule that if I can't say it or do it in front of my mother and father, I don't want to do it. Now, fortunately for me, I never knew my father, and my mother was a crack whore. <laughs> I can pretty much say whatever I want. But that's no excuse. I'm still trying to clean it up. My kid's in the room tonight, so i got to be nice. So I need someone's help. I think someone close by here with a good arm. One of you guys got a good arm. One of you gals. What I want to do is bring this list of dirty words over to you, okay? Come on up here, honey. Thank you. What's your name? Kate. Kate, ladies and gentlemen. You need a date? Kate. It rhymes. You remember There's the four dirty words. I'm sure you've seen them before. Maybe you didn't know how to spell them, but now you can work on your poetry. Now, when I say one of those dirty words, you throw this lemon at me. You hear me? And don't be afraid. Here, take a second one, just in case I do it twice. Oh, I do it more than twice. Forget it. And you can throw a drink at me. Make sure it's a Guinness. I might get a mouthful. Might as well get something I like. Hi, right. thank you. By the way, that girl you're with, she's a good looking <laughs> Ah, just testing. Just testing. Thank you. See, that's why I gave you two. <laughs> nice move. No, I need help. I'm not kidding. Really, I do. I want to do a few impersonations for you, but before we get started, I got to thank our sponsors. Ladies and gentlemen, Malpaso Coffee, for you drunks, it's a synthetically caffeinated coffee, but don't take my word for it that it's good for you. Let's take Clint Eastwood's word. Ladies and gentlemen, the spokesperson for Malpaso, synthetically caffeinated coffee, Mr. Clint Eastwood. Now, I know what you're thinking, drunks. You're thinking, did I drink six shots or only five? <laughs> well, to tell you the truth, I kind of lose track myself after so much imbibement. But beans as mine is a caffeinated coffee, the most powerful brand of synthetically caffeinated coffee in the world, and will blow your adrenal glands clear off. You've got to ask yourself one question. Do I feel sober? Well, do you, drunks? Somebody ought to drink your coffee, but I won't, I won't, but hell I won't. Now, Passel Brand Synthetically Caffeinated Coffee, go ahead, make my cup. So far, so good. No lemon. <laughs> you said hell, but that's not on my list. Help? Oh, I said hell. Hell is not on your list. Now, if it's in the Bible, it's good to go. I would like to also invite someone up here, anybody who wants to study acting. I've studied some acting. And, you know, if you want to study acting, the best thing to do is study a good actor. So I took some classes at the Robert De Niro School of Acting, and it was wonderful. I loved it. Let me show you what I learned. I'll be happy to teach anyone. <laughs> I gotta tell you this. I gotta tell you this. And if you wanna be a good actor, I gotta tell you. You got a long way to go, mister. You come to this school thinking, man, you're gonna walk out of here with a degree. Well, let me tell you something. I'll give you a third degree. That's what I'm gonna do. See? That's what I learned from Robertson Hill School of Acting. And what I'd like to do is get somebody up there, some volunteer, and I could teach you it. Just have it be just like Robertson Earl. Like this guy here. Come on up here, mister. Come on, I love you. You've been up here all night. Yes. How you doing? What's your name? My name's Rob. Did you want to come up here? No, uh, not really, but you know. <laughs> it's like the narrow. It's like the narrow. Yeah, it's like the narrow. 
take one for the team. No, from the team. Oops. <laughs> what team is that? All right, here's how, here's how you got to do. Just watch me, listen to me, follow me, okay? First of all, the eyes. First, you got to squint your eyes, you see? Squint them down. Night and tight, like see if you can hardly see what the hell you're doing out there. You know, you got to do this. Now, raise the shoulders. That's right, the shoulders. You act like you're doing what the f*** you're doing. <laughs> What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? You know, I try, I try to help these people out. I try to keep them entertained. What are you gonna do? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, you got the elbow, shoulders up there. Right? Squint the eyes. Now, here's the hard part. This is the hard part, and I don't know how he does it. It kind of looks like he's always got to go to the bathroom, doesn't it? But anyway, maybe he does. But anyway, they raise the eyebrows while you're squinting. You squint, but you raise the eyebrows at the same time. It's really hard to do. I'm not kidding. See, I told you. That is hot. I know. I got that. Yeah. I know. No, I got that up. I got that up. And then the other thing is you, you sort of stick your jaw out just a little bit. Stick your jaw out just a little bit. You know, don't go. If you go too far, you become Willem Dafoe. You want to have a date with me, honey? We don't want to be not doing no, don't do no Willem Dafoe. He's too ugly. And, and most, most people don't know who he is anyway. So, so what the heck? No more lemons. Except for my jokes. Yes, all right. Yeah, but at least lemons have appeal. What are you going to do? I'm not, a, I'm not a comedian. I'm Robert De Niro. I don't know about being funny. Didn't you see my Dustin Hoffman movie? I did Wagging the Dog. That was a piece of crap. And that's not on the list either, so I'm good. All right. You got the shoulders going, the squinty eyebrows up, the jaw sticking out just a little bit. Store jaw sticking out. Just ever so slightly, and then you sort of talk out the side of your mouth, like that. So you just sort of shove it out, but don't lift. No lifting. Listen, you're Sylvester the cat. I don't want to do no Sylvester the cat. You know, I got a, I got a reputation on my team, dude. What's the matter with you? What's so funny? You think I'm funny? You think I'm funny? Now here. Now you give me the finger. Give me the finger. Give me the finger. That's right. Now he could have done a lot with that line, but he didn't do it. Give me the finger. Give me the finger. He's still not doing it. He hasn't figured it out yet. What are you going to do? You know, he can't even do the eyebrows. How's he going to do the finger? Okay, don't do this finger. Roll the finger like that. He goes, he goes now, here's what I want you to say something. Don't, don't roll it too far. Don't do it this way. That's not good. That's Anthony Quinn. That's Anthony Quinn. Are you the son of God? Uh, nobody knows Anthony Quinn any more than they do willing to fall. What are you going to do? All right, so give me the finger, give me the finger, give me the finger. And now what you got to say is, you act real mean, like in front of the mirror, like somebody's ticked you off, right? And you're going to go, you talking to me? You talking to me? All right, try that. Okay. You, you talking to me? Nice try. Let's do the voice. Let's work on the voice. Okay. Okay. Whisper. You got to whisper. You know, so you sort of got to do a whisper thing here. You got to do a whisper thing. You got to talk out the side. Not quite a list, but not you know, something like that. You go... I'm good at it. You are okay. No, now, okay. whisper, whisper softly. You talking to me? You talking to me? Oh, nice Clint Eastwood. Not bad. <laughs> Not bad. I give you. All right. Now, talk in a normal voice. You talking to me? You talking to me? Now, do something right in the middle between a whisper and a normal voice, and you got Robert De Niro. You talking to me? Oh, yes. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Harrison Ford. Thank you.